what do you think will be the relationship with India? Um, whether the incumbent win or there is a new change in the in the in in Washington. Well, you know, I think our shared values between India and the United States are very strong. Our democratic traditions. I mean, you have a, as you know, elections anywhere are can be bumpy and and not beautiful. But it's the best system. The democratic system is still the envy the world over. The Indian democratic system, the U.S. democratic system. So I think those shared values will propel our relationship forward, no matter which candidate wins. I feel firmly about, strongly about that. So uh, you think that there will be continuity in the in the relationship which Obama administration deepened the ties. I really do. I think uh, you know, the, the strong bonds that uh, that have been formed between our two countries, the democratic traditions, the strong people-to-people -people ties, uh, I only see that getting stronger, no matter which one wins. Ma'am, uh, as an American, uh, uh, do you find uh, common things in the democracy? We both are noisy democracies now. So what are the other common things do you think between India and the American political system? Well, I think um, our ability to be frank and to have very good, solid, interesting conversations with each other and say, I don't like the way you're doing that. Well, I don't like your, your opinion on this. And have that really good tug of war about ideas. The sharing of ideas, that's really a great thing about Indians. And one of the things, I've only been here three months, but one of the things I appreciate so much about my personal relationships with Indians, but I think also that strong foundation that we can, we have freedom of expression, freedom of opinion, and we may have differences. Any good and important friendship or complex uh, relationship is not going to be on point 100%, but the fact that we have this great exchange, that's the part about my job and uh, about our U.S.-India relationship that I find so great. My, my last question, where do you think the Indo-American relationship going on from here on, given the fact that in past one, a, a decade, the, the relationship has gone from strength to strength only? Well, as I said, I don't see any reason why it wouldn't continue to go strength to strength. And I, you know, I think we can't pr uh, predict a, a uni, sort of a, a linear upward trend. We're going to go up, maybe take a small step, a pause, up, take a small. We'll always have those pauses to sort of assess and reflect. But I see no reason why we wouldn't continue to have a, an upward trajectory in a very positive way. Well, thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you so, so much. So, so uh, at least there will be a continuity in the relationship, and the relationship is going only from strength to strength.